we are making batteries and supercapacitors out of wood. Today, let's see how we made graphitized carbon for supercapacitors and amorphous carbon for batteries. Capacitors and battery manufacturers are looking for sustainable solutions with the goal of carbon neutral. Biomass, especially wood biomass, would be a renewable option for that. Here, we extracted lignin from wood components and use it to produce carbon electrode. Because lignin has a high carbon content since many benzene rings in his molecular structure. Our study used lignin as a carbon precursor and ZFIT, a mental organic framework, ZFIT as a carbon template to produce graphitized carbon. After ZFIT was synthesized, lignin was absorbed on the surface of ZFIT and they interacted with each other. After that, two steps of carbonization created the co-shell structure of graphitized carbon where Lingli efficiently transformed into a carbon shell and ZFIT changed to a carbon coal. So we obtained this carbon with high conductive region and hierarchical porous nanostructures. At this point, I'd like to emphasize that Lingli could not only convert it to amorphous uh, graphitized carbon, but much easier to amorphous carbon with simple carbonization. The current development of sodium ion batteries requires larger carbon interlayers to store larger sodium ions for in, in the electrode. We found that the amorphous carbon from lignin matches in this case. So in the future, we are making sodium ion batteries out of wood. It's hoped that we could continue to contribute to energy storage materials in the framework of green chemistry and in the goal of sustainability. Thank you.